Hey, what's up? It's always me, Johnny, and welcome to my new video. So today, as you read from the title, we are gonna see some feature that we actually didn't get into the new MIUI 13 update for our Xiaomi phones. So unfortunately, this will be a quick video because there aren't so many features that you can add. We can say unofficially because these are just features taken from the China version of the MIUI 13. There are just a few features but I will show you the way to get it on your phone before you're asking if you are interested into this uh, theme that I have installed right here on my phone. It is called actually, uh, let me see right here, it is called Black Tone. It is this one and you can find it in the default themes app that you can find onto your Xiaomi phone. Anyway, what are the features that we have installed from the MIUI 13 that we didn't receive in the uh, global version of the MIUI 13. And the first one, it is the notification panel, or we better say the control center panel. When you drop down the menu from there, you can see that this is actually the newest version of the MIUI control center panel. And I can already tell you that it is working pretty fine, actually, but the only thing that I think it doesn't work very well it is the music playback right here because if you use Spotify it doesn't recognize the music from Spotify but for every other feature that you can see right here you can trust me that it is all working quite fine and in fact you can see also that you have like a quick shortcut to GPay right here so Google Pay these are redesigned and that's pretty much it I mean this is the first feature that we didn't receive I don't know why still for any of these feature because they are very, very simple software modification, we can say, but we still didn't receive it. So I guess we have still to wait. Then if we go into settings right here, then we scroll down to always on display and we go actually onto always on display. We can find some new clocks here or some new animation effect to just set for our always on display. So you can see here we have some analog clocks and we have the kaleidoscope effects right here. So these are all changing effect like you can see right now. And they are pretty cool actually, nothing special. I mean, those things aren't revolutionary, but it is actually something new to have. And for example, I have this one because I like it a lot because it's very, very minimal. And I think it's actually from the back screen of the Mi 11 Ultra because it's pretty much the same one and it seems like a screen from the Mi Smart Band but anyway I like it a lot actually if you did set up this always on display you will not see any notification I mean you will not see the specific notification but you you will just see a small red dot here near the the clock actually but nothing more so keep that in mind then one more thing that you can install that I think it is from MIUI 13, but I don't know, I'm not sure of it. But anyway, I'm gonna show it anyway. And it is the Mimoji app that you can see right here. And it is pretty much the Apple emoji application, we can say. But I got some problem with this app because it won't show anymore the texture on the image right here. I mean, you can see that if I move my head, it is moving actually, but I don't have the texture anymore but before it was working but just for the video it just decided to not work anymore anyway you can just install it and try it on your phone it is pretty cool actually it is a funny thing to have on your phone then another pretty cool feature and very very useful feature that i have installed on my phone and this is not from MIUI 13 but i think they should add the ability to just do this thing and i'm gonna show you right now what it is so if i go here into settings and then i scroll down to display you can see that right here onto refresh rate i got 90 hertz so what does it mean because if i open it it does only say 120 hertz or maybe just 60 hertz but right here it says 90 hertz and this is a little mod very very easy to do that it can easily increase your battery life on your Xiaomi device especially if you have like a Mi 11 like me or maybe another device that only has 120 hertz display because these are not adaptive display so it just runs every time to 120 hertz so it does consumes a lot of battery and there is a simple trick to that so just go into the play store 
and search for this app right here. Just search for set edit and just download it. Once you have downloaded it, just open it and then you will just scroll down. You will just search for this user refresh rate right here and you can just simply tap on this value right here then you click edit value and you just change it to 90. so if you have your settings onto 120 hertz you will find right here onto user refresh rate you will find 120 hertz so you just click it and just edit value type 90 and you have your screen set it to 90 hertz Anyway, you will not gain like hours and hours more of screen time, but it is something that you can do very, very easily without rooting your phone, without doing anything exaggerate on your phone. It is very, very easy to do. Anyway, how to install all this feature that I have right here. So for the notification panel, we can say, and the always on animation if you are interested into that so just go onto telegram so just open the telegram app if you haven't already downloaded it just download it from the play store just make an account or probably if you search for these files on the web you can find it somewhere but to ease the process i think that telegram it is the fastest way so you just search for this channel right here so MUI system updated and you will find like a lot of apk on here and as you can see right here the latest one it is the always on display release so they've added some stuff on the always on display or maybe fixed some problem and then you can find all of this apk so you just go onto onto the channel you just go onto files for example you can see that we have the weather app the, the gallery app the new camera app uh, some new launcher and stuff like that you just scroll down you can see all the files or maybe you, you can just search for example like system ui controls to have these new controls or maybe if you like to install maybe the new weather app you, you just click on this and it just shows what you will go to install and actually something may not work on your rom because these are extracted from the china rom so most of the times they don't work or maybe like right here it does say uh, not works on global rom or maybe don't install on global rom because you will not be able to uninstall it or maybe it will cause us some problem so for everything that you are gonna install it does say what problems it can have or maybe if it works or not and of course all of this application i will not suggest you to install it if you are not an expert user because if you just encounter some problems you will not know how to recover from them so if you're not like expert or maybe you don't know how android it's working and how these things are working so don't do it pretty much just wait for the official update these are all mods these are all an official apk so of course do this at your own risk but i repeat if you are not expert don't do it i can suggest just to do maybe just to install the memoji app because i mean it's a standard application that you can find on the web and also do the 90 earth screen because it's very very useful and also you will gain some battery life anyway that was pretty much it unfortunately as i said at the beginning these were just a few features that I succeed to install on my Xiaomi Mi 11. And I repeat, don't do any of this stuff if you are not an expert. And for this video, it's pretty much it. If I have some news, some new feature, some interesting stuff to show you on this version of the MIUI, I will let you know for sure. And in that case, make sure to subscribe down below because it's free and you will not miss that video. And if you like this video also just leave a like down below because I mean it's free and either way thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one bye for now